Ever since Shakira and Gerard claimed to have gone their separate ways, fate manages to make them clash from time to time. In an instance, Shakira threatened to harm Gerard and, as expected, the famous football player clapped back. Keep watching to know more. Valentine's Day took a turn for Gerard Pique as his ex-partner, Shakira allegedly threatened to hurt him. Well, judging by how their love ship capsized, fans have concluded that Shakira just isn't ready to move on. I might kill my ex, the hips don't lie singer mouthed in a new video, lip-syncing lyrics to SCAS hit Kill Bill while mopping her kitchen. In case you didn't know, the track, which has gained popularity on TikTok, is about a scorned woman who indulges in revenge against an ex-partner. I might kill my ex, not the best idea. His new girlfriend's next, how'd I get here? Shakira mouths in the video. I might kill my ex, I still love him though, rather be in jail than alone. I did it all for love, she continued. I might kill my ex, not the best idea. While it's obvious that Shakira is mopping the floor, fans can't help but notice the song she sang has some eerie lyrics. Although we know Shakira wouldn't kill anybody, this new video is showing she is still quite hurt and not healed from everything that happened. A very public breakup that was also followed by a nasty legal battle that has the former couple's children right in the middle of everything. Fans were quick to jump in the comments section, noting the video was particularly shady given her longtime former partner went Instagram official with new girlfriend Clara Chia Marty. A fan wrote, I don't think you guys understand she currently has beef with her ex. She even moved her entire house away from his mom's house, made a diss track to him and she's mopping the rug on purpose to get a message out. Another fan wrote, I don't think she's singing it in the meaning she misses him, but in the meaning she's going to do more things to destroy him as she should, not gonna lie. While some fans are just not buying the idea. A fan reacted, she's really harming her kids spewing so much hate to the father of her children, no wonder he needed out. While another fan commented, she is so obsessed, it's so funny and miserable, while peak enjoying his life unbothered. Clearly, Valentine's Day can be really tough for people who just ended their relationships, especially for someone like Shakira. And her very public breakup with Gerard Pique reached a breaking point just as we have seen Shakira teasing the fans with the revenge song against him and the woman Pique left her for. The woman whose name is Clara Chiamardi has just been presented to the world by Pique through an Instagram photo, and apparently, Shakira shows she is still hurt by everything that happened through an Instagram video she posted. So far, Gerard Pique hasn't responded to the latest diss from Shakira. All he's done so far is respond to La Liga President's publication on how Spanish football has grown in the last year. Year, but no response to Shakira yet. Knowing how Gerard Peak tends to operate, we wouldn't be surprised if he responded to this aggressive post from Shakira. He does it often and through messages between the lines. For now, we can only sympathize with Shakira and the fact she'll be with her kids during Valentine's Day this year. However, theories have emerged suggesting that Gerard Peak has sent a secret response to ex-girlfriend Shakira after her latest song appeared to mock him. So, he did clap back. For those unversed, Peak and Shakira were together for nine years before they split in an explosive breakup last June. They signed a custody settlement for their two sons after a marathon meeting with lawyers late last year and also sold their five-story property in Barcelona. The former Spain defender has since moved into a penthouse apartment with new girlfriend, Clara Chia, but his split with iconic singer Shakira took a jaw-dropping twist when she released a new song, which was a not-so-subtle diss track aimed at her former partner. The lyrics saw her take a swipe at Chia for her age and a peek over who he chose to get in a relationship with. They included, I'm worth 222 seconds. You traded a Ferrari for a Twingo. You traded a Rolex for a Casio. A lot of gyms, but work your brain a little bit too. A she wolf like me isn't for rookies. I was out of your league, which is why you're with someone just like you. You left me with my mother-in-law as a neighbor, with the press at my door and a debt to the taxman. The music video for BCRP Music Sessions Ball 53 has gone viral, racking up more than 133 million views. It has also been streamed more than 50 million times on Spotify, with Marco reporting the song has earned her more than two pounds and 50 cents M. But here's what is interesting, Peak has also hit back at his former girlfriend, signing Casio as a sponsor for his new footballing venture, Kings League. He also turned up to one event in a Twingo, but insisted his actions had nothing to do with Shakira's song. We have an agreement with Casio. I'm serious, we have reached an agreement with Casio for the Kings League? Yes, because we have many countdowns. This watch is for life, I'm telling you, Peak said when he announced the deal with Casio. According to Marca, Peak has also gone further than merely signing that deal, with the Spanish paper highlighting the number plate of the Twingo. The license plate read 2511MDJ, which is reportedly a secret message to Shakira. The 8,000 pounds car was a deliberate choice, following Shakira's declaration in her newly released song that the former footballer had traded a Ferrari for a Twingo, when he started dating his new partner Clara Chiamardi. On Friday, the Kings League president finally took a jibe at Shakira over her song's lyric in which she compared Clara with a Casio watch while she likened herself to a Rolex watch. To this, the former Barcelona defender replied, 
Casio has sent us wristwatches. We reached a sponsorship agreement with Casio. The Kings League struck a deal with Casio. During the show, Gerard even flaunted his gray Casio watch, adding, this watch will last a lifetime. Clearly, Gerard Peake has sent a message to Shakira that he truly is done. I buy Lenos, the fellow streamer, was bemused and remarked, you must be joking. However, Gerard did not budge and immediately handed everybody a watch on the show. Well, looks like Gerard wants the world to know that his focus is on his business deals and his newly found love. Speaking of which, Gerard Peake has publicly discussed his romance with his girlfriend Clara Chia for the first time, admitting that she's the one who wears the trousers in their relationship. The former Barcelona player split from Shakira in June 2022 after 11 years together amid claims he cheated on her, and he went Instagram official with Clara last month. Now, in an on-air chat with Spanish streamer Ibai Linoz, Gerard confessed that Clara chooses his clothes for him when they go shopping together, comparing himself to a puppet. He said, The truth is I go with my girlfriend to the shops and she buys them for me. I'm a puppet. Let's see if fans are excited about this new love story. A fan wrote, It's only Peak that knows what he went through in the hands of Shakira. Man looks so relieved in this photo. We all are very wise when it's not our story. You don't know the trauma Peak may have gone through too. Another fan added, He's really making his new relationship that was formed through cheating publicly. Like are men really that shameless these days? Well, shortly after Peak and Clara were first spotted in public together, they were also seen attending a wedding in Catalonia, Spain. The pair were seen walking arm in arm and sharing a laugh with one another while also mingling with other guests in attendance. Although Clara is very private, Peak isn't one to keep his business a secret. Additionally, while the couple have been together for less than a year, Clara and Peak have traveled together several times. In addition to outings in Spain, the couple have also vacationed in the Czech Republic and France. While in France, Marty and Peak stopped in Paris, where they were spotted sightseeing while riding electric scooters with some friends. Clearly, Peak isn't shy to show off his newly found princess and fans are hoping Shakira could really move on. Well, that'll be all for now. Stay connected to enjoy more entertainment.